Turning now to the latest in the search for Andrine McDonald. A local search and rescue group says they are not giving up on finding Andrine and we're out today looking for any clues that could lead them to her. The group mostly of uh, made up of military, former military service members formed about three months ago when Andrine first disappeared. They call themselves the chain breakers and say their aim is to assist in situations involving domestic violence, runaways and missing persons. Today marked phase one of their planned three part search for Andrine. They told our crews today their search party consisted of about 40 to 50 people, but what they wouldn't say was where they were actually searching. If there's potential evidence out there, we don't want to disclose it right now. Therefore, having some, giving somebody time to go over there and remove it before we get there. Um, it is a heavily wooded area, so that's pretty much it. Andrine McDonald vanished under what police say were suspicious circumstances back in February of this year. Her husband, Andre McDonald, has been charged with tampering with evidence in connection with the ongoing investigation.